Yeah. He did it, everybody. We started as raindrops, my friends, and we became an ocean and learned how to disagree without being disagreeable. I want to be a representative for all people in our district. Yeah, yeah. That includes, that includes, that includes everybody who voted for Eric Paulson. I thank Eric Paulson for his 25 years of service to Minnesota and our country. I'm pleased to announce I'll be holding my very first town hall meeting in the city. Yeah. It will be accessible. Yeah. There will be no tickets needed. Yeah. It goes without saying, everyone's invited! And my heartfelt gratitude to all of you who made it possible. So <laughs> We're the coach check girls. You know what that means, honey. My name's Cindy Round. Where are you from? Eden Prairie. Eden Prairie? You're a longtime Democrat? I am a longtime Democrat. I take it you voted for Eric Paulson. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> nope, did not. First time ever I um, volunteered for campaign also, so I door knocked and phone bank and yeah, this is great. Jennifer Shower. Where are you from? Yeah. Eden Prairie. Eden Prairie? Sure. You've been working on the campaign? I have not. Okay, but you voted for Dean. I did. Okay. Good. What do you think of him? You know, I really like his message in general. Um, I like the everybody's invited tagline. I also have been trying to attend a town hall with Eric Paulson unsuccessfully. And I listened to Dean and Eric's debate on NPR. Did you vote for Dean? Let me think. <laughs> Absolutely, and I put in lawn signs for him, and I passed out literature, and I knocked on doors, and I gave him money, and I phoned for him. Other than your neighbors. Oh, and I convinced my neighbors all to go vote for him. Is Carol Schreiber? Where are you from? Plymouth. Liesel. Where are you from? Minnetonka. Minnetonka. That's where I live. Oh, good. And I take it you voted for me. Yes, I did. Why? Because he represents optimism. He represents the future. He represents civility. He represents listening. Minnetonka Mills, okay. near the Dairy Queen. Yeah. 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 My name is David Center. Where are you I, from? I live in Shanhassen, okay. Minnesota. Okay. And who did you vote for this time? Well, I voted for Dean Phillips. He's a really decent. Who did you honest, vote for last time? Uh, for last time? Two years ago. Uh, I forget the name of the woman. Terry uh, Bonoff? Yes, Terry Bonoff, right, yes. Okay. Why'd you vote for Dean? Uh, because he's a decent, honest uh, person who uh, whose uh, policies and uh, ideas uh, mesh with mine. I like the fact that he uh, stands for health care and campaign finance reform and climate uh, climate change uh, improvement and uh, and uh, suppressing gun violence. Why did you vote for me? I'll take it. Yeah. I did. Uh, I just think time for a change. I don't think Eric Paulson represented our district um, or my values. Why are you here? Because uh, my mom's friends with him. Oh, okay. Also, like, this is pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't know. What's your name? My name's Lydia. Where do you live? I live in Prospect Park in the city, like Minneapolis. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Kind of Where's a drive. Your mom? Is this your mom? Yeah, that's my mom over this, there. Is this mom? Yes, this is mom. And why are you here? Why am I here? Because What's Dean is a great candidate. My name's Wendy. Where are you from? I'm from Bloomington. Bloomington. Right? Yep. And why are you here? Because I'm a great supporter of Dean Phillips. To tell, I told a friend of mine the other night. I haven't been to um, like at an event on election night since 1972 when I was in college and I was in the Sioux Falls Coliseum when McGovern got absolutely clobbered by Nixon. So I'm hoping for a better result. Well, I'm super excited for Dean Phillips and I'm ready to just like get this done. Kerry Bloomfield. Where are you from? Minnesota. Tonka. What's your name? Susan Ryan King. Where are you from? I'm from Eden Prairie. I voted for Dean very early. Actually, I voted uh, for um, Terry Bonoff two years ago, yeah. 
Not Eric Paul's Mark. Mark, where are you from? From Minnetonka. Minnetonka? Where? Uh, well, near where Hopkins High School is. Oh, okay. Yeah. That, that neck of the woods. Yeah. yeah. Okay. We're hoping for a big Dean victory tonight. Yeah. 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 Why'd you vote for Dean? Why? Why are you supporting him? I take it hard. Uh, I, um, yeah, I think that, uh, I, I like Dean's ideas. I, I feel like he he wants to make progress on health care and on gun control. Um, he's willing to listen to what people have to say. I'm very thoughtful like that. And you are supporting Dean? I am supporting Dean. Do you live in? I'm in Eden Prairie. What's your name? My name is Katie Simons. Okay. Yeah. I'm a huge Dean supporter. I met him two years Why? ago. Um, Why in the world would you support Dean Phillips? <laughs> Why in the world would I support Dean? Because Dean Phillips, to me, is an old school listener and conversationalist and easy to talk to. Um, his tagline is everyone's invited and he really means that. You could talk to the candidate too. This is Steve Elkins running for Okay. Better talk to him than okay. me. Okay, yeah, well, give me your name. Elaine Rothman. Oh, absolutely. He's a shining star for the future. Um, he, his, his youth. He'll, he represents our millennium, and uh, he's the hope for the future. I am Steve Elkins. I'm the Democratic candidate in the uh, House District 49B. 49B. We're in 49B as we speak. I'm Sandy Alston. And you live in? I live in Shorewood, Minnesota. Okay. And I take it you are supporting, you support? Yeah, I just supported okay. Dean Phillips and Kelly Morrison for the House seat, 33B. How do you come to vote for Dean? Oh, because he's energetic and he's authentic and he's a fantastic. He's going to upset Congress on the Republican side. My name is Brad Schenkel. Where are you from? Uh, we live in Minnetonka. And uh, my wife Adeline has been uh, one of the early volunteers for the Dean team, and I've been her spear carrier for the last uh, 17 months. When I put my glasses on, I can uh, read the house numbers for door knocking easier than she can. I guess a self described political independent for the 40 some odd years we've lived here, voted both Democratic and Republican in the past. I'm just uh, was overwhelmed by the toxic environment that I see coming out of Washington but pervading Minnesota as well. Uh, gridlock in the Minnesota legislature bothers me as much as it does in Congress. So I reached the point of saying you can't complain about it if you don't do anything about it. So in my own two cents worth, I try to help Mr. Phillips because I believe he's a Shanti. And you live in? Eden Prairie. Oh, yeah. And why are you here tonight? To celebrate Dean's victory over Eric Paulson. And guess what? Dean has support from our communities. Jaime, what do you think? Of course. You are? I live out in my center. And uh, we have like 15 signs in front of our lawn. Okay. Even though it's a minority, we will see. Bloomington. Bloomington. Why are you here tonight? So hopefully couldn't find anything better to do? Couldn't find anything better to do. No, we're here to celebrate, hopefully, the win of Dean Phillips. Okay, why? Why did you support Dean? Well, the alternative was unacceptable. Good old Eric, pants on fire, Paulson. I have to go. My name is Jill Holter. I'm from Minnetonka. Okay. This is my husband, Carl. Oh, okay. Why are you here tonight? Because we used to be Republicans and now we're Democrats. Okay. And we're proud of it. We worked on Dean's campaign, volunteering a little bit. Okay. And we couldn't be prouder to be part of it. We met him at the Penn Lake Library and we just knew he was going to be the candidate. So she went and said, are you a Democrat or a Republican? He's a first grader. And the kids are like, I don't know, you know. And Raina is like, well, 
the Democrats are nice people. <laughs> and all the kids were like, we're all Democrats. And I'm like, oh, that's nice. What's your name? Tandi. Where are you from? I'm from India. So thank you. Happy? Yes, obviously. <laughs> and you are Aura. Yes. I am ecstatic. What's your name? Colleen. Where are you from? In the uh Edina. Edina. Yeah. So, you're really happy. I, I'm totally happy. I I have confidence, I have faith, but this is great. <laughs> I'm Kia. I'm Daniela. Congratulations. Thank you so nice much. Nice to you. Beyond excited. We're so proud of our dad. We're so proud. Such proud daughters. But a winner to all these people and for everything they did. So that's, that's our words of wisdom for the night. How are you going? Yes. I'm Bill Swan with the update. Hi. Congratulations. Thank you very much. We're talking for you. I'm Kathy. 